Hi Church, uh, today's prayer, we're in week two, uh, day nine here, uh, praying through difficulties this week. Uh, today the difficulty for us to focus our prayer is um, an openness to new traditions, uh, the difficulty of letting go of old ones and taking on new ones. Galatians 1.14 says, I was far ahead of my fellow Jews in my zeal and for the traditions of my ancestors. And he goes on writing here. He says, traditions of any kind are difficult to let go. They provide a sense of status and order of comfort and familiarity. The Apostle Paul appreciated traditions, yet he was able to let go and adopt new traditions. Some old traditions may stifle growth. They may no longer serve their original purpose and may be unwelcoming and confusing to new people. So, that's what we're praying about. Uh, traditions are important to us. That's what why we hold them as traditions, right? So, um, let's just pray through this today and see where the Lord leads us, all right? God, we thank you for your grace, for your understanding to, to be at work in our lives, Lord. We ask you, as this... As our new church begins to develop its new traditions, Lord. Uh, as each of our churches begin to discern which traditions are not going to be held. Not gonna, we're going to loosen our grip on. Lord, that is a, a fearful thing. Uh, but Lord, it's, it'll only be done as is necessary. We can trust that that is the case. God, we're going we're gonna to pray for grace and understanding with each other as we seek to understand uh, why traditions are present. We're also going to pray for an, an openness to establish some new ones. As, as we develop a new ministry, Lord, a new unified church, that it will have a unified, unified traditions, God. New traditions that hold us together. Uh, then not to hold us with the past, but hold us who are here presently uh, together. Lord, prepare us for that. We ask for a creativity, um, a, a caring spirit as our church develops these new traditions that, that honor who we are, who we used to be, and also who you have called us to be. God, that uh, we hold all these things together and that you would lead us to discover and develop new traditions that would honor all of this. And glorify you. Because that's what this is all about, Lord. This is all about bringing you glory here in this place. God, I ask you that as we move through these difficulties this week in our prayers and as we begin to move through them as uh, churches, God, that you would lead us. That you would guide us. And you would use us, Lord. So that you and your name would be glorified here in this place. We love you and we praise you, God. We thank you. Thank you for being with us. Amen. Amen, church. God bless you. Have a fantastic day.